Firefighters are bracing for strong winds in Northern California, where the deadliest wildfires in a century have claimed at least 76 lives. This weekend, President Trump saw the damage for himself. And now, as Meg Oliver reports, he's promising help to rebuild the communities. President Trump surveyed the damage caused by several destructive wildfires across California and pledged to help rebuild communities left in ruins. We're going to spend the money that's necessary. Uh, is a, a great great people that live here and it's unfair to put them through this so often. Emotions ran high as hundreds of displaced residents waited in long lines to meet with FEMA officials in Northern California Saturday. The president's visit received mixed reviews. He'll come in and try to take credit after he's insulted the firefighters, the police, the military, handicapped women. I'm happy he's coming and I think it'll add some brightness to a lot of people. The Butte County Sheriff estimates that the fire destroyed 9,000 homes. I see devastation. It's gone. Oh my God. It's my childhood right here. I mean. We were with Eric Smith when he went to check and see if the deadly fire spared his mother's house. Some of his relatives are among the more than 1,000 still missing. You see the numbers of missing and that's a lot of elderly people here. Hundreds of people left homeless and living in tents in a Walmart parking lot are facing more misery. Heavy rains are expected next week, which could trigger flash floods and mudslides in areas scorched by the wildfires. Meg Oliver for CBS 3 Eyewitness News.